Hello and Happy New Year to you all wherever you're listening or watching from. This video was meant to go up as a roundup at the end of 2022 but time has always run away from me so we're, we're starting a week late and doing it as a look forwards instead. To start off with just a massive thanks to everybody for all the support over the last 12 months. We smashed through the thousand subscribers mark on our way to 1500. All the comments they all get read, all the, the likes, the subscriptions, it, it really really helps us out and we're, we're really 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 grateful for it all. We've had a pretty good year, we've got off to our first couple of tournaments at the North Remembers and some South Shields events which were fantastic, first time we've been to fantasy tournaments in or a decade probably if not longer. Um, really really great to, to meet some of you guys out there at those events. It didn't end quite as we'd hoped with the the car crash on the motorway, which has sort of wiped out the Empire Army. Um, we've got some plans and things in place to get them replaced and repaired, so hopefully they'll be back on the tabletop before too long. But again, thanks to, to everyone for the, the kind words and the comments after we, we sort of shared that news with you. Looking forward to 2023, we've got quite a bit going on and we're quite excited about it. So start off, we've got two new armies who should be making their debut. I mean, you've you've half seen one of them with the High Elves before, ages ago, but uh, there's been a lot of work on going with them. And I have a second mystery army. We're off to a couple more events this year as well. We're off to Cardiff Crusade in March and the latter Triple Crown event in June. So if you're going to those, please come over, say hi. And then we've got the Enter the Bunker, sort of our guest challenges, which we talked about a couple of years ago. COVID knocked it on the head for a while. Last year, we had so much going on with life in general. It wasn't really an option, but we're definitely keen to still do it. Need to work out a few little logistics, but pretty hopeful that we can get that up and running this year. We've also got an option now through YouTube for uh, channel memberships. A subscription service and um, uh, we swing two ways with this really I've got mixed thoughts on it but it, it's an option it's something we're going to have a little look into and consider we'll see what sort of extra content and extra material we could put out for you guys whether there's any sort of appetite for people to to do it um, we'll see it's not something that's definitely going to happen it, it, it's just something for us to sort of look into really let us know what your thoughts are on on that one as well social media I don't have much more of a footprint this year on social media I'm fairly rubbish with all of that but Shell has taken over the reins for our Instagram and uh, other accounts now so we're going to have a bit more of a presence on there so you can see what we are up to in between battle reports rather than us just disappearing for a month and then resurfacing with a new game keep you guys in the loop with what we're working on what's been going on what's been happening here in Yorkshire um, I think that's it for the year ahead quite a lot of stuff we're quite excited about it and, and what this year holds hopefully it all sounds good to you guys as well. So stay safe, everyone. Keep one of those sixes.